over how to find the area between two curves. The formula for this is area equals the integral from the interval a to b function f of x minus function g of x x. So this would be like say this is f of x and this is z of x I'm trying to find it on the interval a to b we'd be finding right here f of x is always the upper function so we're trying to find the area under this curve subtract Dang the area under this curve to find the area between right here. Um, a question can it either ask um, and it will a question can either ask um area on a certain interval or if the interval is not specified we have to find the points where they where the functions intersect uh, with the calculator or by hand so the first thing we're gonna do is start with a pretty easy example example one find the area between f of x equals square root of x and g of x equals x squared on the interval 0 to 1. So the first thing that we have to do is graph. So, uh, for this first step, I'm going to use light blue, the graph. I already know what it looks like because I've worked it out before, but you can either put it into your calculator or make a table of values. So, I know this one is the f of x equals, and I know this one is g of x equals x squared. So we are trying to find this area right here. And now, since we graphed it and we know that this one is on top, we can plug it into the formula so to plug into formula so the formula area equals a zero to b Thank you.
Whoops. Uh, two. One. Square root of x. We know this is the upper function minus x squared. The lower function. And we are going to now solve, which I'm pretty sure everybody knows how to do that. So I'm going to not explain that. I'm just going to do it. If you don't know how to do this, I'm sure there is another video somewhere. So the area equals one third, and that is how you solve that. Now, let's go to a more difficult example where the functions intersect at more than one point. Um, here. Of equals three x to the third minus x squared minus ten x and g of x equals negative x squared plus 2x. So the first thing that we do is still graph to see which function is on top and where they intersect. So... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right. All right. So this is G of X. And this is f of x. So we will be finding this area plus this area. So first things first, we need to find the point of intersection to be able to find the interval. Because we will be doing, we will be plugging in, into the formula as a equals the integral of a to b f of x minus g of x since it's on top on this side. And then the interval area equals the interval from b to c g of x minus f of x since g of x is on top here. And then we'll add those together.
find the points of intersection, you can either um, plug these functions into a calculator and see which ones and see what the points of intersection are. Or you can do it by hand by just setting them equal to each other.